Hello everyone. Today I will guide you to the next part of Project Archviz. Last time I showed you how to use the SketchUp's simple tools and basic steps to start a project. Specify dimensions and display on drawings. For your convenience, I will continuously update the previous sections below the description. If you do not understand something or need an answer, if you want to add anything, please comment below in the comments. Every video. By the way, if you find it interesting and useful, give me a like and sub, so that you can receive notifications about the next video tutorial. Thank you. I will continue now. Today we will draw the door part. Các bạn vẽ đây thì nó có hiển thị là mặt cửa nó sẽ bao quanh Đây Use the command rectangle Dùng lệnh rectangle If you don't know where it is, when I press Press the shortcuts you see but you don't know what it is Then look here, if there are some See you like I'm done if you don't say the shortcut, just look here and it will show up. Offset. Scale. Everything is here, I only teach the basic commands for you to draw easily. There are some things that I want to do faster, I would like more instructions. The order number in the plugin below you can find more. Column section here. Here also. Cái khu cửa là nó sẽ tiếp giáp với cái phần này. Đây mình vừa vẽ cái cột đấy. Ta muốn cái này xuống. You just move along the coordinate axis. Bạn cứ mua theo trục theo trục độ đó thì Move it up and down, it doesn't skew. Easier alignment. Wherever you do it, you group it. From the group I will switch to components. I will show you how to mirror. To the other side. Like. To the opposite side. If you need to fix it like you. Want to make a door, but you have to fix both sides. Just move the middle part and it will automatically put it in the center. You do it manually like this. Batch copy. Well, I'll mirror it to the other side, now copy first. Then use the scale command, enter yourself minus one. Like this is a mirror. Move it in. Its location needs.
Is there a way like this? You find yourself. Plugin JHS Power Bar. It has many applications. Extrude follows a certain line with any line or curve. Follow the water pipe, water pipe. I don't need to go through many operations. Using plugins has many benefits. Divide the road. Or solder the points together. Weld. Just clicking here becomes a continuous line, isn't it? As interrupted as at first. It has a mirror in it. So that I can mirror. Find yourself with the midpoint, if it's difficult to determine, just draw a line for yourself. Then I will use with midpoint. Find midpoint. You drag it along the path below. Drag the red axis equals X, the post before me. Wrong Y axis. Y is green, red is X. Mirror. This one is more convenient. Mirror is that it uses coordinate axis. A coordinate axis here. Create a plane here. Take here from the midpoint so that it is opposite through this place. Is this midpoint? Make a landmark. Now let's draw the door frame. This one has grooves. Low rise ledge. Please look closely at the picture. You open yourself X ray. You want me to draw. Draw the plane here. I don't know if it's the right one. Then you guys. Follow that wall. Hold shift this it will automatically follow this. Automatically follow the wall. There's another way, what guides should I use? Some others are more complicated, so I follow the direction. This is simpler than I let it follow this baseline. 
làm sao các bạn cứ rút lại cho mình nhé xong rồi bỏ cái ray đi turn off x ray tắt đi cho lên này Draw this it has many offset ways or draw vậy. each edge. Mình cứ một là vẽ quét hết. Sau đó mình offset vào. Nhanh hơn. Còn không thì vẽ từ cạnh một. Draw rectangle. Thì bây giờ mình làm cái kiểu rất ca đi. Nhanh. 410. 10. Above is back below. Bên trên đây với lại dưới bên dưới. Nó sẽ có cái ray. Một là cái ray đó. How will people do it? Âm là thế này. Mình cứ cho cái này xuống. Cho Bring mưa. down 30. Pull it in. Sau đó mình offset. Mình put, put nó vào. Cái bàn mặt này. Where do you go? The group goes there. Make a door. It has three wings. One comma two comma three. Make three sliding doors. Next group. Group tiếp. Xong rồi. Chia cho nằm bài. Xong rồi xóa cái này đi. Please offset. Nào offset à. Offset là lệnh ép. See door thickness. Ta xem cái độ dày của cái cửa. Lower bar high. Đây. Dưới nó rất là cao. Above negative input. Bên trên là âm lên trên. Có cái phần uh, treo ở dưới đấy. Do you see Để purple frame? Phần màu tím như này. Cái... Just hold cái shift. Cần đi theo giữ shift là nó ra cái điều này. Sau này nó cứ xong nó sẽ cứ giống theo cái đường. Đó rất là hay. Make it tall. Lên cho nó cao Cao của nó là 70 đi 40 Up to 30 30 nữa. It's an outer frame Trên đây là để làm Nó làm một cái khung Bọc bên ngoài này Sẽ Âm ở trong cái, cái, cái hộp này You guys group this. À, các bạn rút cái này là à, nó đi tí mình làm cái kính It is glass. Còn cái này là một cái thằng làm dưới chân. 
rút lại các bạn rút hết cho mình nhé 40 Clear vào cái này 40 Và này Make component Make component như mình, như mình cái này nhé Còn đây là cánh cửa Sau đó chúng ta copy này It's a sliding door Chỉ cái phần này là phần cửa lùa nên là sau mỗi cái trên mỗi cái phần cửa lùa này The contiguous part here is not the same as the contiguous part bằng tiếp giáp với nhau đâu It's common Ở that it will be left nó below sẽ dư, nó sẽ đẩy dư ra Move it out. Đây là chúng ta mua nó ra. At 40. Đưa vào nó là 40 Cái này cũng thế When you draw. Khi, khi bạn vẽ thì cứ If you can make components Even better Component được thì càng tốt as many components as possible when you export it to UE. Each of these components will reduce the amount of space. Instead of importing dozens of objects into UE, then with only one component copied, it only needs to import one object. It will be light for my project file. Show the glass inside. Common glass is 10 to 12 millimeters. Press the keep key. It will show hidden lines. We select the mid object. Is the midpoint of the group. Move it to the midpoint of the other group. So it will be in the middle. Faster many ways I add, subtract, multiply, and divide it will take a long time. Create glass material. Uncheck texture. Opacity is blur. Transparency display. The lower the opacity, the more transparent. 30. đưa nó vào 20 
Put it close to. So slot equals five or three. Bye. We'll draw the groove in a bit. Sliding doors will have rails. Here is the track. The more realistic, the better the drawing must be. You can copy the plane too. Đó. Các bạn cóp mặt phẳng rồi, cóp sang đây cũng được. Delete the line. So is the other side. Just copy. Copy is fastest. đây là nó sẽ có một kia đường ray mấy mấy cái ổ bi này a little deeper above đó giờ chúng ta tau is the material steel thép nhé cái này sắt sơn luôn Remember to remove the opacity. It is transparency.
If you feel it's not black enough, you can adjust it more. Door edges. When the boxes are adjacent to each other, there will be ledges and grooves. If you want to know after rendering, in the render does it show those grooves? Turn off edge. If two contiguous points lie on the same plane, then you won't see that groove when you render. So I'll have to bring it up. One is to bring it up, two is to use a plug-in to edge it. Round Connor. Need for work that makes your work feel real. That's the way the edge is rounded, but in reality, it has to be soft like this. But not to square, sharp like this. I use this. Its name is Round Connor. The plugin you go to find, but it is not in the default SketchUp. Round Connor. When we edge, the render will be very realistic. Before exporting to Unreal Engine, you have to re-edge the whole thing once. Bow all edges again. All models just made. Example you did. The color is full but I find it too dark. Can't find anything to fix. If you don't want to change that color, go to monochrome. Turn it on. That way you can edit comfortably. Black as much as possible. Remember to make components. Learn how. Use components for smoothness later on. Construction will be easy. Necessary. Change will also be simple, not too complicated. Just scan the whole thing. 
For example, if you use extrude, pull slash push, then have to pull up each side. Have to pull up many times, very long. Just scan the whole thing and move it out. Save time. These two doors are too long. Đây là hai cái cửa rồi nó dài quá rồi nha. This is why I recommend mirror. Nên mirror là. Many times when I edit this door, I mirror it. It will be faster. Realign each point. Make unique because it has the same component as other doors. So make sure to make it unique. Create a new component based on the old component template. Already. We will add materials for this. It is aluminum. Here it has a part. Box around the door.
thì số material như, like wood like this if you scale it up cái vật liệu như gỗ như này nếu như bạn co vào or stretch co it out kéo it. nó ra thì nó the deviation of the texture is very much what if some materials don't have a specific shape then it's okay to scale again as much as possible limit copying as much as possible For 200. It's also a box. For example, when you draw a rectangle, looking at the plane, it's blurred part of the edge. Is the hidden stroke which means it's not in the same plane as this one. So it is being deflected, i.e. not on the same plane. If you don't fix it, just leave it for later when you see it. In some cases, I move using the move command. It will be difficult to correct an error. Use that side as a landmark. Drag it in. You will be simple but it is still standard. Go low. Hey, it's also one. Looks like it's a wooden frame. Wood frame. This place is closed. This one he didn't draw. Don't know what it is. Just ignore it XD. Do something else. Đây. 
This is the tiered wooden slats. We will. The wooden bar there is the same as here. Iron like above. ta sẽ làm cái sàn gỗ của mình đây. Add materials for this place. The material here will be a bit old. However, it's the floor so it will be a little shiny. When you look for a map, look for a map that's a bit larger in size. If it's too small, it will be broken.
Note, when you look for map, texture, notice the junction between the textures. The junction between these two is faulty. This one it goes uneven. Let's find another map. This is what I was looking for before. It's more beautiful. There it was surrounded by wooden panels. Four twenty. Đấy thì hiện tại thì mình thì khi các bạn up map xong rồi ấy, cái phần này nó sửa cái này lại một tí It seems like a lot of work but it has to be done like that to make it realistic. Must be very, very detailed. Don't go through the speakers. Because you keep wondering why I draw but it still doesn't feel real. Here it will have the wood part. For example, the clear wooden panel is too small, you can't find a map like it. Hey, the color or the wood grain is like this. Then when I press scale here, everyone jumps. Right click, choose texture position. Here will be some tools to customize. Red moves. Green zoom, or rotate. The other two colors just change the angle. Parallelogram, other polygon. Like this, it will be the same material as above.
Here is adjacent to the water. We will make concrete map. Moldy moss. Đây, tôi lấy cái này đi. The concrete part of the house. Concrete used for the floor will be shiny. For example now, the parts where it's colored it feels uneven like this. And if there are some cases where the investor, how many parts are required? They took them to take a picture of the map and send it to me. And it's like this. How to fix it now? Open with this in Photoshop. You hold this layer and drag the plus sign. It will copy out, or press Ctrl plus J. Is it copied? Go to filter other offset. Here. 
When offset it will show the continuation of the map. Show me the part where it intersects. How to fix it now? Copy, Control plus J, continue. Click on the vector mask, then select the white image next to it. Find the brush tool. Find the brush image that fades out. When you draw in white it will not affect the original image. Keo full opacity. Pull up again. Do it twice. Why did you choose for yourself? White. Then it will show this picture. Black. Then this looks like it's been deleted. This is me. Now click on the plus sign to create a layer 0. Layer absolutely nothing. Shift plus control plus alt plus E. That it will copy what I have to layer 0 there. You do it one more time. You do the same for once again like the other side, how do you make it horizontal? Pull down. Still choose this. Use brush to erase. Connecting part. Redo the layer okay. with nothing and press okay. shift plus control plus alt plus E. You open the offset again. To test. Then you can just do it so that the result is no longer contiguous. If you don't use the mask, you can delete it.
To delete, you press E key. You should be careful with this one. Delete a lot when it's too much, it's lost. Still using the brush image as usual. That's it for now, if you have time to practice, make it a little more beautiful. Save copy as it again. Of course, I did it a bit carelessly so it wasn't very pretty. When adding maps, note. Outside, there will often be moss, mold, and moisture. Like this. You just add the whole thing, it won't be realistic. Our lesson for today ends here. Next post I will guide outside, outdoor. This side of the house, the way to do it is the same as the other side. In the next post, I will show you how to get models from 3D warehouse. If you don't understand something, but need me to answer it. Leave a comment under the comment section of this video. By the way, if you find it useful, please give me a like, sub to get notifications about the next 